many unbearable hours later. Welcome, welcome one and all to the next video. So today I really want us to go to a bunch of caves and we really need to get those, um, what do you call it? Those Bellanoa slabs, you know, uh, for the summoning the new boss. So we got one already. I'm thinking we just go and just run straight through caves and figure and make sure we try to get those slabs as, as quickly as possible. So let's go do that. Um, now, in terms of breeding, I know I said that once we got a good menacing, I would try to breed it with something. We got a menacing with... Can you stay still? Yeah. D hey. Anyways. It has swift runner and nimble, okay? You probably saw it for like a millisecond. And we had a Suzaku with just nothing on it. So I decided to put them together. Uh, we had one with swift and runner before, so there's a few eggs. And I put it with our other Suzaku, our Suzaku Aqua. So we will eventually get something. We have 15 minutes remaining, yeah? Okay. So wait. Ooh, wow. Did Brad get faster? Or was he? I swear he wasn't. He was faster for some reason. Okay. Anyways, whatever. Yeah. So let's go straight to a cave and see what we can get. <sighs> of course, the first cave that I check is closed. This cave, I swear, this cave has not been open the entire time we have discovered it. On to the next one. Okay, and let's see. And this one is closed too. I swear, Pal, Pal, Pal World is trolling me. I'm so tired of these caves. All right, let's see. We're going straight to the one that's east of this one. There's no way that we can't get a cave that is open we have so many like I, i'm trying to find one that you know is not just like one of the weak low level ones like that might oh yeah okay that one's open but we just ran out of stamina <laughs> oh no it's fine we didn't land straight in the water and look like fools so it's all good should we just attack these bee gods for fun Tell me. All right, Brad, uh, do your worst. I think we've already caught enough bee guards. We don't really need to care. I just don't want this literal bomb going off near me. Okay. All right, take a shot. Wait, you're not dead. Hello. Okay. I just need these bees. Wait, I'm stuck inside of it. That was weird. Okay. You know, sometimes you just need to see some bees die, okay? Just ignore the fact that this is not even part of our mission. We've been tortured by these bees enough that they need to go. As a matter of fact, it'd be really nice if we can catch a gory rat. Ooh, that's a wrong sphere. Six percent. Six percent. Oh yeah, we have the ring of mercy, by the way. So we got a hundred percent. Just like, oh, you're dead. All right. Well, you get to see it. What was that? No, that strange. Okay. Yeah, but we still need to catch gory rats because remember we we still wanna. We have like what five more levels to go, six more levels to go. Still have a lot that we can get. Yeah, well, four more levels to go. I didn't even... Re oh, right. We just leveled up. <laughs> I leveled up um, just randomly as I was just, like, doing, you know, yeah. stuff that you all wouldn't even really care about looking at. Um, like, putting the eggs and placing the pals and all that shit in the breeding pen. Yeah. Okay, so fell bats. I know we need fell bats, right? I'll say don't attack. Fell bats. Please. Wait. God, the, this ring of mercy is gonna make it so easy to catch pals. Just because you can just get them to once you get them to one HP, it is trivial. Can you not hit my unicorn, please? Thank you. Alright. I don't even know why I'm using legendary spheres. I don't need to. Yeah, like look at that. It's a bunch of loop moons here though. Alright. Two. So, yeah. stay in the pile sphere. Like 39% chance of the mega sphere. That's, that's actually still really good. 
the horns on his head grow under the moonlight. It doesn't hit the sun. It really fucking dislikes it. I don't know what it said after. So <laughs> that's why I just said that. Uh, okay, let's see. Free pal alliance. We don't need to care about those people. Um, yeah, hope you all really enjoyed the random Nintendo music I found. It's a mix that will be down in the description. This has like a, a, an assortment of Nintendo music. I figured that would be, you know, a nice change of pace compared to just listening to Pokemon music the entire time. Uh, so, why are you here? Also, why did my flame breath not go off? That was weird. Okay, uh, this is actually a waste of time. Give me a look. Did Ragnarok get fatter? What is this? What? I swear I used to be able to fly through there with Ragnarok. Do we want to catch us? Why not? And the nice thing is that even though the Ring of Mercy prevents us, like our character, from killing pals, it doesn't prevent your pals. Unless, and look at this, right? Lightning streak, go. Oh, wait. You get the point? So yeah, your pals damage will cap at uh, one HP if you're mounting it, which I think is a very, very, very good uh, implementation of that, because that means you can kind of just use, you could turn the Ring of Mercy on and off effectively, which I, I like. Um, uh, ouch. I didn't like that. I was, uh, I feel like that was a little bit rude from that Catrus, you know? Kind of just running through the cave, minding my own business, you know, just being black. All of a sudden, somebody shoots some flames at me. I don't really get it. Oh yeah, nice. Found the boss already. It is Gale Claw. Alright. Um <laughs> at first I thought maybe we should go for a uh what do you call it? <laughs> an electrical owl just because they're flying, but that's not how this game works. But we'll go for Catrus. Catrus who has Catrus, do you have all okay, you have all dark types. I forget that Spirit Fire is actually a dark type and not a fire type move, even though it sets piles on fire. Um, okay, why is there like an infinite number of gear claws though? I want to kill the non boss ones with Catrus. Just because we can't, it is very, very difficult. Um, take this off as well. Yeah. So is it Ugh. This is what happens. Catrus, please do something. <laughs> Can we recognize we killed that one? But yeah, you see when there's this many pals, it's like borderline impossible to dodge all of them at the same time. Okay. We just need our shield to come back up. If our shield come back, comes back up, we could actually survive. Right now, which one? Okay, so they level 23 and level 24. We should go to this one shot. Can I reload my rifle? Are you gonna allow me to? Okay, so that one is a boss one. Oof, I'm probably gonna die, aren't I? Ah, yeah. I wonder if we could cheese this by using legendary space on them. Yeah, we can. <laughs> okay, so we got one. Yeah, okay. Yeah, because they're like a, a what do you call it, a more common pal. We could just use the legendary spheres on them, even at high HP, and just not care, which I like. Um, now, Grape Rush. I need you to help me murder this Gyoko. Well, at this point, these aren't even the boss ones, who cares? And we finished Gale Claw with this boss, which I like. Alright, nice. Now, do we get anything good? I don't even know, is it worth getting these carbon mushrooms? I haven't tried any of the healing items yet, but I don't... I don't even know how to unlock it. Oh, no, the new healing fruits, I think you only get them from the bosses, but this healing item that you can make with these mushrooms, it's called... But well, this says that you can make healing medicine. Uh, anyways, so we got training manual times two, and we got high grade technical manual. And this is what I'm talking about. Bellanor slab fragments, so now we have two. 
Very nice. On to the next one. All right, nice. I went straight west and I found this Akiv in the icy area, though. So let's see. The boss is level 45. Fuck it. Let's see if we can actually even do it. I'm actually kind of glad it's nighttime. There's the PAL genetic research unit executioners. And whatever, these genetic people, they will fucking run after you for so far. Uh, if you've gotten this far into the game, you've probably experienced this, where they they chase you forever. It is uh, not good, especially because we take so much damage in this um, series. So we have to kind of just try to avoid any of these fools. Now, the nice thing is that it is nighttime, so they're asleep. Is it? Yeah, yeah, yeah they, they cocked that gun, even though they're asleep. Uh, gold key, eh? Hmm. Oh, I should just use this. Technology points, very nice. Okay. I took off my hat because it's gonna break soon, but we can't we can't do this chest, which is annoying. There's a bunch of tombats over there. What I'm a little bit afraid of is that the tombats hit the researchers and then they wake up and all of a sudden we die. Before we even get to the boss. Which I would hate. Now Oh, they just spawned. Ooh, Marif? We've never even encountered this pal. Let me see. Can we even do this? Um, I mean, we need... We, you know, it's funny. We don't have a dragon type that we really use yet. But yeah, because... Ow. Get away from me! We spam shotgun. We might be able to do this. All right, nice. I think we can capture Marie up there. My, it may... Let me get my ring. Let's see. Alright, stop attacking it. No! Marie, if you come out of the palace fair, you're gonna die. Wait, you didn't die. Ooh, that's a very annoying bug. That's the bug that we got. Um, this is that fucking dashing bird that I can't even remember the name of. You know what's funny? We caught two of them and both of them had mine for man. Hmm. Uh, maybe they're mining. Maybe they like mining in their free time? I'm not really sure. Not really sure why both of them have mine foreman. Anyways, we're gonna go through here. And I think this is the next way, right? Yeah. Did they add anything else besides these mushrooms to the caves? I don't think they did, right? I mean, they added like the good drops and everything like that, but. No. The nice thing that. Um, the reason why we actually carry around our pickaxe, even though we don't even mine, is literally just because every now and then, as soon as we see quartz, it's best to just mine it because it's so sparse. Like when you need it, it's just a massive pain in the ass to even, um, you know, farm it. Kind of hoping they keep it this way. I feel like they should not add a quartz like mine. You know how they added the what they got the mining spot. Uh, if you don't know, they added an ore mining site and an ore mining site too. I wonder if they want to add like a coal mining site, a quartz mining site, a sulfur mining site. Maybe they add some new ores. What is this? Oh, this is pallium. This does not look like pallium. Okay. Well, we don't need pallium, so. Just gonna dodge that. You know, there's a chest spawn up here, but like. Hmm, whatever. Oh, it's D time. The genetic researchers are gonna. Yeah, the genetic researchers are awake now. Can we just sprint through them, or is this just straight up gonna get us killed? Okay, we're alive, so there's that. Now, where's the boss? I feel like we've been in this cave for literally forever. Oh, is this the boss? Yes. Alright. We'll play something doable with our team comp. I. If it's not. We will try it, but... Is this... No, there is a boss for sure, because... Oh! Oh! Ew! Key. I do not... <laughs> oh, I would have died to that, by the way. Like, 100% I would have died. Alright, we at least have a fire type. That we... He does one each. He does one damage. <laughs> no! We can't do the boss. He does one damage to... Oh no. Oh wait, no. That, I mean, this time around he did. 
Hmm. I guess it depends on where he hits them. The nice thing is the oh Brad, you can't die. The nice thing is that if we he sets them on fire, he does percent max HP damage. That's what the burning thingy majig does. Oh, what um hmm. No. Brad. We can do this. We can't do it. No, you might be asking why I don't mount Brad. It's because literally because we will move too slowly, but let's try it. Don't like the lock the fact that you're locked into position is the shitty part. Ah, okay. Um can we rest up here? Are they gonna kill us? Yep. We will die. What about down here? Just need to get stamina back. Eesh. Okay. This it would be really, really nice to have a rocket launcher right now. Or or fire grenades. Which we oh yeah, we used to carry our own fire grenades. What happened? Ah uh, falling out of the air. That would have killed me, by the way. Oh, oh, this will kill me. Brad, get some stamina. Get some stamina. Okay. Fuck this. Yeah, it's just way too hard to dodge. But honestly. No, uh, um, that hit me for so much. Okay, I can. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Grape Rush, I really wish you had fire. I should have given Grape Rush fire damage. Um, because he has a bunch of fire attacks. Is this? Are you catchable? Nope. I think I'm gonna die. Yeah. No, I'm not dead. All right. Ooh, I think the, yeah, the frost would kill me. Can we get back our shield, or is it death over? Oh, this one has a nine percent chance. Okay, come, 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 come. Stay in the power space. We got it. We got it. We got it. Okay, nice, nice. All right, we just need to get back our shield, and then we probably survive. Fuck. I knew as soon as I couldn't dodge roll because of the rocks, I was going to die. Honestly, that wasn't too bad, though. We could 100% do that, boss. Just need to not fuck up. All right. Let's see what we get from the huge dragon eggs. So we did get a bunch. These huge dragon eggs are different, have different parents than these other ones. But, you know, still, what do we get? I don't even see what, what is that? I didn't see. Oh, it's an Astagon. Holy shit. That actually is so rare and so good. Let's see. We got Astagon with Brave, Swift, and Runner. What's the other one going to be? Runner. Okay. I like it. I like it. I mean, we're going to wait until these ones actually pop out some children to see what good stats we can get. Because we can get all three speed passives on one Astagon. And then that's gonna be sick because honestly, at that point, we could just use Astagon as our like. Uh, I don't want to call him a murder pal, but like, if you, you've not, if you haven't seen Astagon, let me show you. Let me show you. Uh, let's go. So, sword by Pal deck. Wow, he's actually not even down here. Okay. So we have one of Runner, Hooligan, Brave, and Swift. Honestly, I almost want to just like use this one for a little bit. I mean, it's kind of pointless. Yeah, but yeah. This is this is Astagon, by the way. Look at that. Now, do you see this shit flying towards you? Does he smile though? We if we pet Astagon. Oh, that's so nice. <laughs> okay, this cave in comparison should be an absolute cakewalk. I mean, the boss is probably gonna be like level twenty or something. Level 13. <laughs> uh, it's going to be really nice. You know, it's, it's nice every now and then if you go from being the, bu the bullied to the bully, you know? Like, you know, as you as you get better in some, like, first-person shooter, you just go from just, like, ha people having people just, like, shit on you to just dominant pe dominating people. That is probably the best feeling. 
Now, is this the boss area? Normally, it gets marked by those little tree thingy-majigs, but... No? Okay. Hmm. I swear there was some sort of pattern, but I feel like I might have just been seeing things. Nice thing is that we at least got a... Well, we got a pulse fair and some gold. Did we finish Kilimari? Yes. Okay. Kilimari, I'm gonna spare you. Okay? Hello? There's no way you're that cute. It's just ridiculous. Of course I can't attack them. Alright. We made it to the boss. The boss is probably just gonna be some... Squishy pal. Doesn't even matter what it is. It would be nice though, because it's an alpha. It'd be kind of cool. If it was something we wanted. It's a T-Fund. Adorable watering can. Ah, uh, you're very dead, so I'm sorry. Eesh. You know what? We'll capture him. Maybe. Maybe? T funds. Alright, 93% chance says no, we don't capture him. I like all. I love um, gamers, especially like me. We just treat. Um, like a 90% chance is 100 is like, what do you mean? There was a 100% chance. Ah, you know, stupid bullshit. It's like, I mean, it wasn't a 100. What, what do you expect? Got these poor elephants. Okay, nice. Also, why was there only one T-Fund? There should be two. There was only one boss T-Fund, right? It got electrocuted with a shotgun blast. Not the ideal way to go, but you know, honestly, if you die instantly, it's better than most deaths, right? I think. Can <laughs> that was a very odd angle, first of all. Um, yeah. All right, maybe we get another part. Hopefully, should should be right. Let's see. Belnor's slab fragment one, times one. All right, and we got Ancient Technical Manual, too. Ah, that's so nice. All right. Okay, yet another Cakewalk Cave. Let's see. I swear I saw a Lithmog effigy just now. Was this in my imagination? It's possible. I might be hallucinating. Might be. Ravine Grotto. Oh, they both are at least level 19. A little bit of a challenge. Oh, this song is from Kirby's Return to Dreamland, which is a game I never played. I feel like, for some reason, even though I've played a lot of Kirby, I've mostly just, like, replayed Kirby and the Amazing Mirror, like, ten times. <laughs> uh, I should probably branch out. I do wonder, though, if anybody knows, let me know in the comment section. Are there, like, new, like, good, well, there's probably new Kirby games, but, like, are there good Kirby games at this point? I don't know. I feel like I never hear anybody talking about uh, like a new Kirby game. <clears throat> Which I would play. Like, I fucking love Kirby. It's just so... <laughs> uh, his, his antics are just too... They're too good. And you have all these other small little tiny multicolored Kirbys. It's like, uh, what do you call, you'd call that? Um, some sort of inclusive workplace, you know? Every Kirby's a different color. I'm sure that's what they were going for back in like 2001, right? Okay. Boss, where are you? Where art thou, boss? Oh, it's sheep. Hmm. Sheep. Hello. We even caught sheep. Yeah, we finished all of the sheep. The woolly poops, as some of us call them. Ooh, you are not having a good day. I am so sorry. I'm even dodging attacks. I probably should be, though. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Hey, hey, leave my missing no alone. What's your problem? Tell me that because I came into your home and attacked you and your friends. Are you gonna attack me back? Yeah, insane. Okay, there's one, there's one more just alive. This poor guy. Watch his entire crew just like disappear. Taxi caught candy. 
Okay, if we get a Bellanor's uh, slab fragment here, I believe we can summon who? Crossbow schematic one, not Bellanor slab fragment. Well, the journey continues then. All right, we're gonna fly straight over this goblin. We're never gonna stop. Brad, just keep, just keep going. Just keep going. No, get actually get get the lift more We need that. The tell that uh, we are literally nothing. How many of these do we even have? Fifteen. We need like twenty-seven at this point. Ah, all right. D d d d Run! What level is the boss? Twenty-nine. All right. We could deal with that. We could deal with that. Free pal alliance devouts. Gonna run straight past them. We don't even want to deal with them. Uh, I know I saw some fell bats over there, but honestly, I kind of just want to race through the cave. Now, ooh, Petra says, fell bats again. Okay, fine, fine. Since you're here, ooh. Probably just use the legendary spheres, right? Ooh, you died. You're also not dead. Wow. I stop missing. What is this? Alright, because he was CC'd, I'm pretty sure we just automatically catch him, right? Yeah. We are here. The boss is the cutest pal. The floppy. Ah. Almost feel bad for doing this. Almost. Wait, the only one thing though, I want Brad. I hate Ignis Breath so much. Let's put back Flare Storm. And then we should have something like Air Cannon. And we can do Spirit Fire. All right, nice. The reason I don't like Ignis is I don't like... um. Was it Ignis Breath, whatever it's called? Is sim is literally just because it locks you in place and then you just die. Nobody wants that. Alright. Let's actually just use our oh, ooh, ooh. That actually hit really hard. Alright. Wait. I could have sworn they were floppies on the ground though. What what just happened? What? Um also, we need this. <laughs> God, that is that feature is so useful. Just knowing like which pals you need to catch. Ah, fuck, pay you deserve all of my money. I feel like I should just buy this game twice. Uh, if I was rich, anyways. But I'm not. One thing though, I swear these bristles are not taking damage. Right. What? You, you dare slap away my pals, fair? Fuck you. Come on. Wait, dog. There's no way. Look how angry it looks now. Holy shit, he does this one angry face. I. He is not happy. Also, he uses eyes. Hmm. Okay. Well, um, yeah. Wait, how am I able to capture this one but not the other one? Just looking at the HP um, when I was able to capture this one compared to the other one, it did not... It doesn't really make sense, but okay. I ain't gonna question it. Nice. Let's see. Can I please get another slap fragment? Yeah, so it was apparently no. Well... Let's keep going. Night caving. What level? 29 again. All right, cool. Very violent, these types. All right, we don't need Luke Moon anymore. Luke Moon, relax. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Let's go through here. See what we find. Honestly, at this point, I feel like I just want to race straight to the bosses. Just want those slabs, and we are not getting them. We've got... Is this... I think we've done two caves in a row now where we did not get the um, Velano slab, which I feel like is trolling. I feel like it should be a little bit more common than that. Anyways. Okay, um. 
Yeah. Just gonna dodge you guys. It does really annoy me that Ragnarok, for some reason, is no longer key friendly. <sighs> Gotta. Uh, it's the worst. It's the worst possible the update. Because Ragnarok, you can, like, speed through the caves and also fly at the same time. But, like, now, what do we use? And who else is of similar size compared to Ragnarok and also fast, you know? In in terms of like a flyer. Like maybe But Geo Geoclaw is a glider, not a f not a um not a flying like another mount. So um, I don't know. Meh. Alright. Boss. Loop moons. Loop moons, loop moons, loop moons. They do not look happy with me either. Ow. Stop. Stop. What? My shield. I swear my shotgun is taking forever to reload. <laughs> so I'm trying to get all the weak ones for this just because they still hit hard, right? No matter what. So we might as well at least get the weak ones just so we don't have to deal with a bunch of um, attacks coming at us all at the same time. It's my my logic got that attack that attack looks so sick and at least it's not like um what's the one the samurai one <laughs> that, like you can't even dodge it we could maybe cheese this yeah we could 100 percent cheese it what i mean by cheese is that i'm literally just catching them instead of getting their hp all the way down because fuck that yeah nice all right this one we could kill blue Kill him! Or freeze him. Do something. Take a shotgun. Oh wait, that was not a shotgun, that was a rifle. You know what? Take take up house fair. <laughs> I, I, sh I don't know why I should I didn't need to actually get up because that attack would have taken so long to actually get to us but you know I panicked I want to get hit even though I have 3000 HP because occasionally that HP gets deleted we got two slab fragments in one go all right let's go see if we have enough okay we do we have five finally god huh all right nice well, at this point, we want to go and summon Bellinor. Now, we know Bellinor is a dark type, right? So we should probably have at least one dragon. I'm wondering who to take. So we could take Blue, Brad, Speed Racer, and then Misty's Nightmare, I guess? We could put a dragon type attack on Misty's Nightmare. Or what about Missing No? Missing No is mm, not exactly the most useful for combat. Now, what about our links? No, Marie. Hmm. Let me see. Let me see. Great brush. <laughs> Quivering. Quivering. Yeah, we're definitely taking Quivering. This is one of the reptile crits that I caught in the cave. It's yeah, one of our highest level pal. I think it is our highest level pal. Holy shit. Wow. All right, well, let's see. You know, another thing maybe we should do is we should check our eggs. All right, give me some good. Give me some good. Huge dragon egg, nimble, swift runner, brave. Okay, that's decent-ish. What about this one? Swift and runner. Swift, nimble, runner, and then workaholic. Where did that workaholic even come from? That's so random. <laughs> No, I'm thinking we could take the one with, um, was it Brave? We could take that. We got Fox Pox from, I don't know, that was just a random egg I picked up. Now we have one more that we can check out. So come on, huge dragon egg. Do your best. Swift, nimble runner. Meh. Meh. I mean, what are we breeding, right? We're bre Oh yeah, right. Because we only have random stuff. Alright. 
Well, let me go and train up this Astagon to like a level 2 to ish, and then we shall go summon the boss. Oh, jeez. As, as I was setting up for Bellanoa, we got raided. Jesus Christ. And ignore the fact that like all of our pals at the mining base are depressed. That was, um, they're out of food. It's okay. It's okay. We'll put them in the pal box. And everything will be fine. Oh. Can I, can I teabag this guy? <laughs> Fuck you. Alright. Um, let's see. Oh, that's the actual raid. Alright. We're gonna get on Quibble and just rain destruction on these fuckers. Alright, let's go. Acid rain, go! Ooh, what? Where does Rip Tyro come from? What the fuck? Oh, that's part of the raid. Jesus Christ, am I gonna die? I'm also literally on fire. I can't. I'm gonna die. I'm actually just dead. <laughs> I put on the heat resistance shield. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Is this worse or better? <laughs> Ah, uh, whatever. <laughs> please don't burn down. And please, can I just get all my stuff? Where's my stuff? Oh, I was on top of it. All right. The German type put out the fire. Thank God. Where are the brothers? They're across there. Well, thanks for fucking up my base, guys. I really appreciate it. Okay, so I put the, mount the mounted machine gun. I pointed it at where I'm guessing Belnor will end up. And now we have... Lunaris on the mounted machine gun. But I mean, oh wait, this isn't even built. Oh no. Alright, well, uh, this is gonna take a while. We did it. Alright, now, Lunaris, I'm gonna need you to stay on this machine gun. Let's see. How do, do they not? I really wish there was an animation for like when they actually assigned it, but okay, cool. So I put eight of our biggest and brightest pals quite literally and now we're gonna summon Belnor, right so i already made the Belnor slab i'm hoping all we need to do is interact with this so we have to do f open then you put a slab on here and then it says summon powerful pal if you summon a powerful boss at your base there's a chance that all structures in your base will be destroyed and all pals on base will be incapacitated would you like to proceed with the summoning? I mean, yeah, obviously. Um, let's see how this goes. Wait, it has 29. Wait, oh, holy. I did not expect to have 290,000 HP. Oh my fucking god. Alright, Belenor. Um, can we catch this one? I have 146 legendary spears. I literally prepared. Alright, so Lunaris is only machine gun. Lunaris is only machine gun. Oh. Does the machine gun not actually do anything? Is that what I'm learning right now? Is the machine gun purely for funsies? Holy shit. Jesus Christ. Right, we just need to not die. That's like actually our oh, only goal. What the fuck is this? Whoa! This is actually sick. And also scary. Let's see. Uh, capture it. Zero point. Appears to be immune to spheres. Ooh. Yeah, well, we can't capture this one. I mean... What is it doing? I, I want my... Sword rifle. All right, nice. Oh, my gun broke. Well, that sucks. Where's the bell? No, I can't even see where it is. Where it is, but we can't hit it. Also, we have no pizza. Um, bread. Shit. Okay, don't get hit by that. <laughs> this like insta kills you. Ah, actually, we're doing good damage to it. We have eight more minutes to kill it, though. Let's 
trying to go, and go for all the headshots, you know? Jesus Christ. So we basically he's gonna burn all of our assault rifle ammo on this shit. That's actually insane. Where did Belnor go? Ooh. Well, um... Feeling down because of bad working conditions. That's how my pals feel. Oh no. Well, I don't think we could see Belnor, even though my pals again ruined. I'm not good. She teleported. What is broke? What's that sound? Um, where'd you go? Can't hit her though. Alright, nice. We are out of assault rifle ammo. I guess we just use a single shot as rifle now? Is that even a good idea? Maybe I need like 500 assault rifle ammo. Would have probably been better. Alright, I mean, we get 300 damage per headshot. I missed. Honestly, this is so hard. Our brave bird, we need you. Yeah, that's what I have named our Astagon. Is brave bird. After, yes, and it is after the attack. I mean, none of our pals have died yet, which is incredibly surprising if you think about it. <laughs> Honestly, why don't I just go and add a bunch more pals to the pal box? Um, I don't want any of this. Get, get out of my inventory. Come. I'm gonna sort it by level quickly, and then we just put a bunch. It doesn't even matter who. Maybe put like a blaze hall knocked, why not? With grape brush? Sure. <laughs> this is actually more of a mess than anything else. Where's Bell now? No. Across here? Holy shit. That attack is sick. Okay, we had five minutes in and we have done about half HP. Now we did add a bunch more pals. So I'm hoping we can deal do this. Ooh. James Baxter Varan became incapacitated. We don't want you to die though. I'll say at this point, just spam the shotgun. Ow. Jeez. Uh, we have no food. That sucks. Wait, I know where there is food. Everybody's just starving. Even though, I mean, there's a bunch of pizza here, but, you know. You no know pals could be. Yeah, we just... Uh, is there so much garbage on the ground? Ooh. That's, um, what's going on? Three minutes, half HP. Can we do it? I'm just going to spam my shotgun at his head and hope for the best. Almost out of shotgun ammo though. It would have been go going really hard. Is we needed? Holy shit! Yeah, we needed maybe some fire grenades. You know why? Because of the percent max HP damage. It purely because of that, by the way. But our entire um, lineup is dead. Come, all of you all get out.
you know i realize now why they change um the pal box to heal your pals is because a bunch of your pals is gonna die against bell and war wait that was actually i don't think we could do this first of all we're out of ammo i didn't realize i needed like 300 shotgun shots um jeez Wait, I'm inside of her. Holy fuck. Jesus Christ. Reboot's attack is highly effective against Bellanoir. We might be able to do it. We have two more minutes. He 3000 HP. Might be able to do it. I have no ammo though. That's the only thing. Guess I can use my crossbow after this. If I could even get it without dying. I mean, we're hitting now. Uh, crossbow, 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 crossbow. <laughs> this Bellanoir is just insane. I can't hit her though. Alright, let's see. Who can we swap out? We need to swap out. You, you, you. One more minute. I don't think we could do it. From is that our pile, piles are dying so quickly? Maybe if I didn't run to shotgun shots, we would have been able to do it, to be honest. It's not too bad. thousand HP. Ah, jeez. We, I think we would have been able to do the um, more of our pals just stayed alive. God damn it! Time out. Oh, holy shit! All right, well, um, yeah. Well, thank you very much for watching. That was Bella Noir. This attempt. Insane. But yeah, thank you very much for watching. I will see you guys soon, and uh, yeah. Take care.